I want to take your golf swing to the next level and this tip right here is going to do that. A lot of golfers in the golf swing will pick the club up with their hands and arms like this and in the downswing they chop down so it looks like you're out there and just doing this with lumberjack, you're splitting wood in the woods, your ball's going off the planet. Life's not really fun because golf is life. So to make golf more fun, which makes life more fun, we need to get away from picking this club up and making your swing all hands and arms, all of that, which is very inconsistent, and get it into being more of a body swing. Getting away from the picking the club up and turning to something that looks a lot fuller, a lot better. And some of you might be thinking, well, I can't get there because my body won't let me get there. Trust me, your body's designed to get to that position if you let it. So let's go to that pickup position that a lot of you are struggling with. And I see this a ton of time in lessons. It's almost everywhere on every driving range. Go look for it. You'll see it looks like this. The club just gets picked up like this. It's hopeless. Flip and pick up. Pick up and flip. That's the worst pickup line I've ever heard. If you want to really love this golf ball, if you want to really smash it, you've got to allow the shoulders to do the job. So picking the club up is no shoulders. You can, see, you can even see it right here. My left shoulder barely moves when I pick up the club. It just stays right here. But if you want to transform your ball striking right now, you've got to get this shoulder moving that way, across the chest. Whew. That's the difference between you being inconsistent, powerful, and it's such a slight difference. How do we feel the shoulders? Well, you got to get used to the feeling of this whole unit working together. So to feel the shoulders, I like the idea of extending the arms straight off the body, like this. So my arms are perfectly straight, kind of like I'm pushing up against a wall, and I want to keep the arms straight like that, but swing them back so that they point at the camera. So when I do this, I'm putting my hands at you. Stop in the name of the law. When I'm doing this, my shoulder is moving across the chest. And even this shoulder is moving behind me. See, pickup world, pickup sticks don't work. There's no turn. And it drives me crazy when I see this because you got all this potential right there. Bring that shoulder behind you. Bring the shoulder across the chest. I feel my body engaging now. I don't feel like my swing is just one giant pick up and drop and it's really powerless. Every golfer will improve from this. You need this to play great golf. You need those shoulders to move like that. If you want consistency, they have to move this way. Of course, you're tilted over, so this shoulder moves more down. But either case, the shoulders are moving now instead of pick up. Inconsistent, consistent. You choose which one you want. And my bet is on you want to be consistent because that's why you're on YouTube looking up golf tips. So I want to take this same feeling to the golf ball. And we do that holding the club out in front of us like this. We can rehearse this really well. Just swing the club back while keeping both arms fully extended. That is a shoulder turn right there. That is majestic. No, not picking it up. Don't do this. I see you. I know you're out there. One of you out there is doing this right now, picking it up. Oh, that's my turn. Watch this shoulder. You need to see a mirror. Go to a mirror. Just look at this. Look at this shoulder. If it doesn't move, you're picking up sticks. <laughs> if it moves, your shoulder is working. Pick up sticks. Squirrel. Shoulder working, beauty, perfection, great golf shots. Then I'm going to hit a shot with that feeling. Get those shoulders working. There it is. Mm. Keep the smile on your face because you know why. Right in the center. Right on the center. Now what do we do? Most of you know what I'm going to say next. We hit it again. Why? Because it felt good. That was crispy KFC on the center of the face. Deep fried chicken. Whew. So, shoulders. 
there it is again. Really simple, really powerful. Just for giggles. Let me pick one up for a second just to show you the difference. My goodness, I'll never do that again. I don't know how you swing like that. Why would you do that? It's just miserable. That's okay. You've gotten out of that habit right here. You're in a new land. By the way, I've got a free mini course. The top three keys, you need to be a great ball striker. Go.sugudo.golf, check it out. It'll show you how to do this shot after shot. Mm, easy, effortless, mashed potatoes, center of the club face. Okay, so same with the driver? Yes. And with the driver, it's even more important that you do this because you're going to get that temptation. That little golf swing double is going to come and say, hey, 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 how about you pick that club up on that next swing? I know you're doing great with the irons, but why don't you pick that club up on the next swing? And you're going to say, why? I don't want to do that. And then, then it's going to convince you on the next hole to pick the club up with the driver. And then you're going to slice it off the planet and you're going to say, why would you do that? I got my shoulders. My shoulders turning. All right. So it's even more imperative that you get your shoulders working with the big dog, the driver, because if you pick up at all with this club, you are looking at your boat at the bottom of the ocean, your ball at the bottom of the ocean. Same thing, get a little wider here with your hands so you can really feel these shoulders. Whoop. It's a longer club but it's still the same shoulder move. Still the same shoulder move. Watch this. There, that shoulder moving across the chest. Right there. Never stopping. It's an athletic move. It's one you need. And then we're gonna swing. Dang, that was spanked. Whoosh. Actually heard a crack. Whoosh. That full shoulder move. No picking up going there. No pickup sticks. This is just lighting the candle all day long. Here we go again. Complete it. Wow! Good thing there's a net there. That would have really done some serious damage in somebody's backyard. So, Segudo golfers, don't pick the club up, but rather shoulders. Let the shoulders do the work. Picking up is disaster, shoulders is money. If you want to play the best golf of your life, check out my website, segudo.golf. It's a complete golf swing training program designed to build your swing to hit shot after shot crispy, just like that. Life is too short to play bad golf, so get on the track to playing the best golf of your life with segudo.golf. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in a future episode.